So we're here with Chris Duncan, head coach of Scottish Hockey Senior Women's Team. Chris, you've just made your squad announcement to go off to Pisa for the World Cup qualifiers. How difficult was it to choose your squad, given that you've not had many training opportunities because of COVID this year? Yeah, it's obviously been a pretty challenging time since we played the European Championship back in May. Uh, like a change in coach and a very big change in, in system. And I think the preparation for this major tournament, coinciding with the start of the domestic league and the preparations of the domestic league, so actually the girls have had such a massive, massive commitment they've had to make to, to balance both. That's made it even harder because uh, whilst we always know with any selection moment, people are going to be really disappointed. The fact that they've had to give up so much and sacrifice so much in terms of their club commitments and their social commitments over this period of time to be able to commit to the Scotland programme, yeah, it, it was certainly a tough decision. But I think from a coach's perspective, having a tough decision is a really positive thing because it shows we've got a massively, massively evil and positive and exciting group coming through. Some people may or may not be aware that Sarah Robertson, one of the stalwarts of the squad, I think you'd agree, had difficulties getting hold of her passport or getting her passport renewed. Can you tell us if that's been resolved now? Yeah, so when, you're, uh, when your Olympic bronze medalist tells you that she sent off her passport to be renewed, having got home from Tokyo, uh, and then you get an email saying that she hasn't received it back and uh, we're traveling in a week, you get a little bit nervous. Uh, thankfully, you know, through numerous channels, uh, people in the government of the passport office have been able to rally around her and uh, get her passport request moved to the top of the pile. So it was certainly a nice relief to get an email saying that it was now getting printed. Uh, and it should be here for her uh, when she arrives in Scotland later this week. Super. 